Hey, what's up, everyone? I'm Ro Norman, and you're watching DreamJunkets.com coverage of the 14th annual American Black Film Festival. We're at the Ritz-Carlton Hotel on South Beach. It's showtime. The red carpet was rolled out on Miami Beach for filmmakers, producers, writers, and actors. The mix of sunshine and water created the perfect scene for ABFF attendees. We're coming. Write, produce, because film is not my background, but it's, it's my passion. I'm a professional by day, but by night, all of my hustle is, is towards film and music. What I learned this week at the ABFF, the importance of getting your paperwork straight. And I need to make sure that I get all of my clearances as far as for even photography, as well as any image that I didn't create. Celebrities and Hollywood elite hit the red carpet for the festival's movie screenings. Filmmaker Spike Lee and CNN's Soledad O'Brien talk to festival goers about Lee's new HBO documentary called Katrina, Five Years After the Storm. Welcome to a conversation between me and Spike Lee. Um, and I want to start by thanking the American Black Film Festival for having us here, also HBO for sponsoring this event, and to all of you for being with us. We certainly appreciate it. Thank you. Super Bowl, I went straight to New Orleans, which really was right in the middle of Mardi Gras. We were there for four weeks shooting straight, and, and unlike levies, we went to other states. I just came from the Spike Lee and Soledad O'Brien uh, Symposium. Very enlightening. I cannot wait to see the documentary. Um, it looks very good. Update your reels and get your business cards ready for next year's American Black Film Festival. We'll see you on the red carpet. For DreamJunkets.com, I'm Ro Norman.